What's up, guys? Chris here, co-founder of Truth Nutra. We're at truthnutra.com. Today, we're going to be answering uh, and just discussing the question uh, whether or not resistance training increases testosterone. And first off, uh, put simply, yes, resistance training increases testosterone. There's there. Are, certain ways that uh, of training that are better than others to increase testosterone and that's what really what I want to uh, discuss today this is something that I ran across um, you know years ago that uh, provided quite a profound effect so uh, and and I ended up putting it all together when I was looking at the research I put it all together into a formula known as now what I call the testosterone work principle and it's basically the idea the concept that you want to activate as much muscle volume as possible in as short a period of time as possible um, under a certain stress threshold. And I've talked about it here on the channel before. If you want to, if you just Google even testosterone work principle, my my videos or articles will come up on it. Um, and it's that's how you train to increase testosterone production in general. And that's also um, you know uh, a good way to to use things like sprinting and uh, big compound movements to increase your testosterone. Uh, I talk all about it in my book, Thor, uh, which is a specific testosterone training protocol for um, weight training. And uh, Thor is extremely effective. Uh, it's, it's very, very good at doing that. It's very good at getting people extremely strong. And you just feel really good. Like when you train for your hormonal health, you feel very, very good. So long story short, the answer is yes. Uh, resistance training is going to increase testosterone production. Um, however, there are people out there that say even um, doing, you know, circuit training and stuff like training every single day. That stuff not is not. That's that's lazy. I think recommending that kind of stuff. You got to look at really the the equation. I mean, the testosterone work principle is accurate. That's how you do it. Uh, you want to do explosive stuff. You want to do. Um, you want to train to activate a lot of muscle volume at once, uh, which entails compound movements in general. Uh, also training in certain areas that have high androgen receptor density slash are areas that can increase androgen receptor density with training, like your shoulders, your traps, uh, upper chest, upper back, that kind of stuff. Uh, that's going to help and lead to a big impact. And keeping it below a stress threshold. So uh, that's the problem with a lot of these circuit trainings and, and CrossFit and everything is when people, um, even though people do good movements, uh, they, they overstress their body with too much intensity too often. So, uh, what, what happens is they're not giving themselves a chance to recover. And that's where you run into the problems. Uh, because if you go over this stress threshold, uh, your body becomes in a state like a, a, a more of an adrenaline state, a high cortisol state chronically, and that's going to suppress testosterone production. It's going to lead to catabolism, you know, catabolic muscle wasting, just for no reason. Um, you don't need to train as often as you might think. Uh, you need to recover and train hard when you train and then recover. So um, that's really that's really the crux of it. It's very uh, very quite simple. Uh, it's a lot of power training, a lot of explosive training. If you want to read more about uh, the specifics, check out the Thor program. That It's over on truthnutra.com. We have the book. Um, there's also on, in the learn.truthnutra library, uh, you can get access to the digital version. Where it's just, you know, you, get, you can log in and stuff. We also, for people that buy, uh, for all the customers, I really like to support Truth Nutra customers. Um, with education. So for all the Truth Nutra customers, say you buy a bottle of Testro X or Cortigon, for example, Fluorosil, uh, we're going to give you free access to the learn.truthnutra library. And um, that way you can go in there and you can learn all this stuff. So if you really want to get more details, you can go check that out. Um, I'm glad you're watching these videos. If you uh, enjoy the videos, definitely subscribe and, and uh, give me the thumbs up. That helps with the uh, YouTube rankings. And uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.